This demonstration shows how to access real-time data from a cognionic system using the Lab Streaming Layer API. Here we're first displaying the raw data using our acquisition software. Only one EEG channel is used for simplicity. You can see eye blinks, jaw clenches, and alpha wave activity when the subject closes his eyes. Starting the lab streaming layer outlet is simple. This can be done with just one button click on the graphical user interface. Now let's go over to a simple MATLAB script that reads the raw data and computes the real-time power spectral density. The top of the script instantiates a lab streaming layer library, it only takes a few lines, and doesn't require any complex installations. Reading a new chunk of data actually only requires just one line of code. Running the script opens a new plot. In a moment, you will see the raw EEG on the top and the power spectral density computed on the bottom. This is also a good demonstration of the signal quality from a cognionic system. The incoming EEG is unprocessed from DC up to the anti-alias filter at 130 Hz. Note the constant floor all the way up to 100 Hz with a complete absence of 60 Hz line noise. No notch filter is used or needed. The advanced shielding and amplification of our systems makes low noise recording possible even with high impedance dry electrodes. Now let's look at what happens when the subject closes his eyes. As expected, we see alpha oscillations in the raw EEG and a buildup of energy at around 11 Hz in the power spectral density. Upon eyes opening, the alpha waves disappear along with a peak at 11 Hz. Finally, here's a brief view of both our acquisition software and the MATLAB script running side by side. In summary, the LSL API makes it easy to access real-time data from our devices in a variety of languages including C, C++, C Sharp, Java, Python, MATLAB, and more.